we're gonna keep showing up. We're just gonna keep knocking on the door until we knock that thing down. Cal State Monterey Bay's baseball team is heading into the postseason this week with high expectations. Coming off of their best season in program history last year, they have a target on their back. Coach Walt White says it was an abnormal season for the Otters, who at times felt like they were swimming upstream. Had some injuries that um, I think the middle part of the season, we're really trying to find some roles and um, trying to figure out our pitching staff in the middle innings and who's going to finish games. And um, we lost a couple guys early. Eventually, the team got back on track, claiming their third CCAA title in a row. And it came down to the third last series outside. of the year. An experience that right fielder J.J. Engman says will help them going into the postseason. Now we learned to win a close game, especially this weekend, and coming back was a challenge, but brought us closer together, and now we know we can do it. CSUMB is ranked second in the Western region after the NCAA's latest rankings, thanks in part to returning players from last season, along with new faces like six foot six first baseman Jaden Shepard, who's leading the team in home runs and runs batted in. Shepard believes the team just needs to keep things simple and everything will pan out. I think it just comes down to just playing our best baseball. Not, we don't need to be concerned about who we're playing that day, what the weather, nothing like just our best baseball. And if we play our best baseball, then the outcome is going to be the outcome. Now, the conference tournament begins on Wednesday, but because of the team's ranking, they'll have a bye on Wednesday, so they'll actually play on Thursday. And this tournament can very well decide if they're going to be a host for the regional tournament. So it's a big week for the Otters. Reporting from CSUMB, I'm Jake Flores, KSBW, Action News 8. Go Otters. All right. Thank you, Jake.